Come on, Peppy. I'm walking out here where I used to tape my precious little curl chickens. I'd like to tell y'all about it. This is where they are now, every one of them. There's the remains of the creditor that ate them up. Right here in this little spot, that's where my little gypsy, my gypsy queen, lost her life. I come over here. Right here is where my precious, wonderful girl, Chief Shepherd, had the vent bleed. I was trying to take care of, lost her life. Little, I'm not sure if this is where Angel lost her life or Angelica, but there's one of the little feathers, the remains of her. See where that old thing killed my babies. Came in here and killed all of them unmercifully, without any type of feeling. Just killed them all. Never touched one of them to eat. Just killed every one of them. This is their little feathers. I don't know where they all exactly got killed. But I didn't know this is where my little gypsy, we took care of her foot. She had bumblebee foot and we took care of her foot. Many, many times. You see her little feathers. See what's remained of her little feather there. And she's got a lot of little feathers here strolled where that they that beast destroyed her. Look at this. There's some of the remains there. Listen, just take a look at what a pit bull can do to little baby girls. And I come over here. Here's a couple more feathers that probably came from her too. This is a little tree that I planted while they were alive, a little loquat tree. And there's the magnolia tree, my wife. It was just a little twig. And they were put in here in the cage. This was their pen. That dog, as mean as it was, actually went in here. Actually went in here. We had him a bunch of good food. He went in here and he tore up my girls. Just strode them everywhere. He took one off of the nest. Little girl trying to lay an egg in peace. And that old pit bull killed her. Pulled her off the nest and ripped her to pieces. I don't know which one it was. It was my wife took it, took the nesting out because it had a bursted egg in it. Right over here. One of them passed away, and I can't remember which one it was lying there. There's another feather from my little girls. Just look. All that remains, unless God does something for them. Over here, see, there's a plant I planted for them. I gave them some, I planted them a bunch of spinach. I planted a bunch of spinach. A short day later, this is where that my wife's little bit, her little pet chicken, here's one of her little feathers. This is where, this is where a little bit, this is her feather. I can see it, there it is. Mama found her with her head bleeding. I'm so sorry, God. It's over here. This is where my precious little tweet tweet princess was. And she stayed alive with us for six hours or more. She could stand up when she came in the house. <laughs> and she stayed with us a long time. There's some of the feathers there where they tore them out of my girls. There's another feather of my baby. Look at everybody. That's what a dog would do to your children. Pit bulls are wicked. <laughs> They'll kill babies. <laughs> I don't know why people raise those things. Michelle you should, you should love these pitches. Yeah, they're coming through the fence. And their plants now coming through the fence. 
the other coming through. <laughs> See the spinach, how big it's getting? It hasn't been but since the 13th. And that was Tuesday. They passed away Tuesday. <laughs> Oh dear God! <laughs> oh God! <laughs> this is Sunday, but it's like it just happened. <laughs> oh Savior, show your working power, Jesus, please. <laughs> I've been praying since Tuesday that God would bring him back to life and then come back. <laughs> I never harmed anybody. They're precious girls. See all the spinach they're plenty for you, Michelle. A little bit. Easy lay. First laying queen. Gypsy. Tweet, tweet. My big old chief. And my little bit. My Michelle. Michelle love that spinach more than anybody, I think. An angel. My God bless my angel. She was so easy to pick up. And Angelica I was trying to spend more time with them so that they wouldn't wouldn't be so hard to pick up and catch. They felt like I'm thinking nobody cared for me, even though we did them immensely. So you know how it is with your children. Sometimes you spend more time with your children than you do with others. You spend more time with one of your children than you do with others. Sometimes we spent more time with the needy looking chickens than we did others. This was their run, Daddy built them here. This was their run that Daddy built them. That pit bull knocked this big plant over here, that big old huge plant, and crawled under the fence, <coughs> fence here and tore my babies all to pieces with no mercy at all. I had them fans put up in their chicken bin, as you can see. We got them a good tarp and put strands of 200 pound monofilament fishing line across the top to keep the hawks from eating their babies. I used to bring them out here and sit in their run where it was cool in the shade. Here's some of the stuff I planted my babies is coming on up. Look at all this beautiful spinach. I just started giving it to him, Lord. <laughs> See the spinach that they're planted for him, everybody? <laughs> oh, God, if we only could change things. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. See that spinach hats climbing that rope? <laughs> Them girls loved that spinach. I planted that spinach just for my babies. <laughs> and they got taken away. <laughs> Peppy love, come here, sweetheart. I'm sorry. <laughs> but I can't help to help it. I love them girls more than anything I can tell anybody. Peppy. Here. God bless them babies, Jesus. <laughs> Peppy love. Come on, sweetheart. I took a stick here. I'm going to show you what I did. I took this stick right here. You can see it. <laughs> and that morning, this gate, if you notice, down here, it don't want to go behind that brick too good, and I was afraid they'd hit it and put it out. So I put this stick behind it, and they locked my loves in their tomb. <laughs> I really try to be a good daddy to you girls. <laughs> Oh, God. Peppy. Peppy love. Come on, Peppy. Where you at, boy? Peppy love, come here, son. Where you at?
<laughs> they say time heals things, but <laughs> no, I'm almost too weak. <laughs> I'm not even sure I want to be healed. <laughs> not at all. <laughs> I'm out of sad somewhere to stop them from hurting my babies or what have. <laughs> Come on, Peppy. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, love. That's my peppy dog. Him, my boy dog. Come on, son. Let's go in. Come on, love. Come on. That's my baby dog. We had 15 months with our little girls. We got them when they were just little bitty chicks. Just hatched. You folks out there, if you got... Things that you love, try to protect them. This is Father's Day, and I miss my baby children. God bless you folks. <laughs>